a big fish. That's a big black drum, I bet. What is going on, everybody? Welcome back to another Cal for a Wild video or fishing the Florida Gulf Coast. You guys already know it. Back here in Pensacola, Florida, guys, we are going to be fishing for some sheephead here in Pensacola, Florida. I know a lot of you love uh, the sheephead fishing videos, and we're going to be using live crabs for bait for these sheep's head and uh, hopefully it pays on out you know i think right now we're fishing on the pylons actually so we're going to be using 15 to 20 pound test we're going to be using a tiny swivel and probably a half a half ounce lead weight uh, whenever you're going for sheep head you really want to keep your tackle minimal uh, they are very finicky fish but uh yeah but as you guys can see we are setting up camp right now we got all the gear right here we are set up and we are ready to go catch some sheep's head now, as you guys see, we have a ton of ropes just for safety measures. And uh, yeah, we're going to hopefully try to catch some sheep. So. But if you guys are new here and y'all like fishing videos, whether it be surf fishing, sheep's head fishing like today, make sure to subscribe. I post all types of fishing videos here on the Florida Gulf Coast. So subscribe if you like fishing videos. And also, if y'all do enjoy the video, make sure to drop a like on the video. It really helps this video reach more people. And uh, yeah, enough jibber jabbering. Sorry for the long intro. Let's catch some sheep's head, guys. Y'all stay tuned for another episode of Fishing the Florida Gulf Coast. Did you get a bite? Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, my goodness. That's tournament grade, right? That's there. a serious sheep. Oh, my gosh. That is a sheep's head right there. What we came for. Holy moly. Corey, hold that bad boy up. Hold on, hold on. Is that my pull? Yeah. My bad. Here, I'm gonna bring him over here. Nice work, dude. Oh my goodness. Look at look at that sheep's head, guys. Oh, yeah. Corey, hold him up one more time. That is a good one, man. Holy cow. Look at that sheep's head, guys. That is a certified slab right there. What yep. do you eat? A little filler crumb? Yep. That is awesome. I call it, yeah, go ahead and put them down. Oop. Look how big this guy is compared to my hand. That is a Mogan sheep's head. Right on, man. That's right. That is a good sheep's head. Holy cow. Woo, I want one now. Alrighty guys, we have just moved spots. Me and Corey have. We did catch that one sheep head. Um, we did catch that one sheep head earlier. It was a pretty big sheep head, but that was really the only bite that we ended up getting. So now we are at a different pylon. We're going to try this pylon. See if we can make something happen. See if we can't catch some big sheephead. And uh, we're gonna go from there. Like I said, we're using little fiddler crabs and uh, hopefully it'll pay on out. Get that net. Oh, oh yeah, nice sheephead. There we go, that's a fish. That's what we're after. Oh, don't you go in that pylon, bub. Got him? Bring him to me. There we go, folks. That's a raptor. That's a fish right there. There we go. Not a big one, but he's an eater. Not a big fish, but he is definitely an eater. We will take that. Right on. Beautiful Pensacola Florida sheephead. Not a very big one. Oh, he's probably about 15, I'd say, but a perfect eating size. We're gonna go, I'm going to show you guys a little better angle on the big camera. Eat. I'm going to show you what I'm working with here. We got a we got a size four J hook. Beautiful Pensacola Florida sheep head right there. That's what it looks like. These are some of the best tasting fish you will ever eat. Like I said, we're using live fiddler crabs. And we're using a, I'm using a half ounce lead weight on a 15 pound test fluorocarbon liter, CR to be exact, and a size four J hook. And look at the mouth on these guys, look at that. I hope you guys can see it because it's kind of shady over here. But these things fight so hard for their size, and uh, I know there's bigger ones down there, so let's go ahead and drop another bait. Give this video a thumbs up if you're enjoying it. There's a fish. That's a good fish right there. That's a good one. That's a good fish. Hey, get that net ready, Corey, in case it's a good one. That's a good one right there. Oh yeah, baby. Come on up. You gotta talk to them gently sometimes. Oh yeah, that's a good one. It's definitely better than the other one. 
I see him. Oh yeah, what is, oh, it's a redfish. Nice redfish. There we go. Shoot, that's a big old slot too. Come on, baby. Come on up here. Hold on. Yeah, he's a feisty little guy. Oh, come on. Get him. <sighs> Doggone it. Doggone it. Hold on. Yeah, he's a feisty little guy. Uh, come on. Get him. Get him. <laughs> Got it. I, that. Uh, the the freaking oysters. Oh, I was trying to get him. I that was a good slot red. Well, well, unfortunately, we just had a probably around a 27 inch slot on the uh, on my line, but unfortunately, you know, I have a real a real limber rod, so it's very hard to maneuver them. And my line touched the oysters, and as soon as it touched the oysters, it just snapped. So uh, unfortunately, he got off, but we're gonna re-rig and uh, drop back down there and see if we can get another good old, good old redfish or a good sheep's head. Y'all stay tuned. That sucks when that happens, but it's just part of fishing. Hold on, hold on, dude. Oh my God, is that a pompano? It might be a pompano or a permit. Hurry up, come on, bring him over here. Oh, that's a pompano. That's a stud puppy. No way. Bro, get the neck, get the Is neck. Is that a pompano? Yeah, Maybe a pompano or a bird. Come on. Oh my gosh, Corey. Corey. That no, that's not a sheep head. Dude, that's a big pompano, man. Holy cow. Dude. Bro, what? <laughs> Dude, that's awesome, man. Here. Get that, get that sucker. I'm going to get some things for the big camera. Dude, that's a stud pompano. Here, hold on, let me get the pliers. Oh my gosh. Y'all, look at the size of that freaking pompano. We were not expecting that, but that is a good size. That is a good size. All right, guys, look at, look at this pompano that Corey just caught. That is a massive pompano right there. Holy About cow. 17 inches, probably. Dude, that's a good one. I don't know, but that is, inches. we were not expecting to catch this pompano out here in Pensacola Bay. That is a freaking stud. Like we're over here fishing for sheephead on these pylons and that's a good pompano, man. That's so yeah, guys, Corey just got on this nice pompano. We were not expecting this pompano to buy over here at all. And it's not even that it's a, like a, just a pompano. It's a big pompano. I mean, look at the size of this pompano compared to my hand. That is a stud pompano. That, is that your first pompano? Yeah. How about that? First pompano. He is definitely going in the cooler. That's awesome, man. That, that's a great, that's a great way to catch your first pompano. Yeah. Wow. There he is. There he is. That's a good one. He's not. Oh, dang. He came up so easy. I may be able just to pull him up. Oh, yeah. It's not a bad one. He's definitely on the smaller side, but we will definitely keep him. He's probably just barely legal. But these are honestly the good eating size. All right, I'm going to get my big camera out. That's a big fish. That's a big black drum, I bet. That's a good fish or a big sheep head. Give it some head shakes. Woo, look at that reel. Come here, hold this real quick. He's coming. You might need to grab the net. Oh, it's a big black drum. Yeah. Either that or a world record sheep head. That's like no, I didn't see it. Oh. Big black drum, guys. Big black drum. Alright, Corey, get ready. <laughs> big. It's a big black drum, I'll tell you that. It's a good one. Pretty black drum, ready? Look at him in the water. Ooh. 
Woo, he's not happy. Sorry about my hand being in the camera. There's only so much I can do. You gotta be careful because these things turn so much. I'm gonna tighten my drag a little bit. You ready? Go ahead and get down there. Oh yeah, baby. Woo! Look at that slob, guys. He's not a big, big one, but he's definitely a big black drum. Good fight on this limber rod. Look at that bad boy. Oh yeah. All right. That is what just ate that big fiddler crab. That's a good one right there. Oh yeah. Perfect. That's a good one. Look at those big lips. Here we go.